firstly, in terms of kind of aero images, the ability to place habitats in context uh, with the wider area uh, and show important details such as wildlife corridors and habitat complexities that ground-based imagery struggles to do uh, is, is becoming really useful uh, in my line of work. Um, so the example here is just some imagery of ponds, which we're currently undertaking Great Crested Newt surveys on, uh, and the habitat surrounding the ponds and the pond habitat itself is very important for undertaking the surveys. Uh, and uh, there's certain processes such as the habitat suitability index, which requires areas of the ponds covered by vegetation or shading and so on to be calculated. And, and having the arrow images is, is just a, a robust way of uh, undertaking that process and allows you to easily communicate to that to the client and, and possibly the statutory agencies as well. So simple aerial photography is captured with the Mini 3 is, is an amazing addition um, to the tool set as an ecologist. Um, it doesn't have to be ponds, it could be various things.